how's it going everyone and welcome back to Fallout 4. Now right off the bat you probably haven't noticed anything different and I wouldn't expect you to but I went ahead and modded the game as I said I wanted to. Um, yeah that's all I have to say really. I modded the game so you're probably going to be wondering what I did mod. Um, mostly just graphical enhancements. Um, probably can't tell too much from this room because there's not much going on in this room but um, for one, I got the Pip-Boy Shadows one. Apparently, it wasn't a thing before when you had a light source that there would be a shadow, but now there are shadows the when, when you, you do shit with the Pip-Boy. So yeah, I also changed the texture of the Pip-Boy. You can't really tell because it's a dark room, but the Pip-Boy is now black, and it's got a 4K texture, so it looks a lot cleaner. Not that it really matters. I also uh, upgraded the map. Excuse me. Um, so that the map is a little bit more clear as to what uh, is going on. I guess it kind of... Mm, it may have revealed too much, actually. Because I haven't necessarily been to many of these places, but... Uh, okay, but uh, the point of the map was to clarify more of the roads. Not really that helpful, honestly, but... I don't know, I just thought it was cool. Another one that I got... No, no, let me just say that none of these... Um, mods are cheats. Most of them are just user interface stuff or um, another, um, if you can see the, the second to bottom of the of the list it says value per weight that was added in so it helps me analyze like how valuable something might be if I pick it up so like this thing is worth 6.6 .6 caps per per its weight versus this which is worth 120 wow well, not, it's not worth 120, but per its weight, it's worth a lot. So, not that helpful either, once again, but just something I thought I'd invest in. No, not invest in, it was free, obviously, it's a mod, but... I don't know, we're gonna just, uh... I can't remember all of them off the top of my head, but we're just gonna carry on with, uh, Tradecraft. Let's see what happens. <clears throat> Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. So what's this guy's deal? Oh yeah, I got a dialogue mod, as I said I wanted to. So uh, it tells me what my character is going to say. Uh, we're gonna go with X. Your leader was just being cautious. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Thanks. No problem, man. So why did you vouch for me? I was hoping to get some beer money out of it. Alright, let's uh, get back to the good old days of saving before we try something risky. So, tell me. Why did you vouch for me? In our little outfit, it's my job to know things. And with everything you've done, it's clear you're capable dangerous enemy and I'm betting a valuable ally <laughs> it's getting orange it's getting orange but why the trust you can't be taking it all on faith I don't know if we can trust you but I hope we can we just survived a hell of a crisis so we may just be a teeny weeny bit desperate for new members if everything was sunshine and bottle caps we'd probably play a longer getting to know you game but we don't have that luxury <laughs> I was still hoping to get some beer money out of it. God damn. Alright. Going for really? it. Really? Is that all? You just don't give up. Alright. I have a short list of people I think would be a good fit for our family. You piqued my interest, so maybe I asked around. Did my homework. If you hadn't found us, there's a chance I would have found you instead. Thanks for saving me the trip. So Des wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone who helps out with the odd job here and there. What a waste. I'm just going to come out and say this. The railroad needs you. Uh... You sure you need me? Desdemona didn't seem to care. She's just thinking of the time and manpower it would take to train you. And if you were some hick from the burbs that didn't know your ass from a rocket launcher, she'd be right. But I'm betting someone like you just needs a few pointers and a target. Sure. 
You got my attention. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Dez invites you into the fold. Then, if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. Sign me up, boy. Sign me up, then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. So, like I said, mostly just graphical enhancement mods, which you can't really see in here, but I got, like, the Wasteland Enhancement mod, which just makes the, the land look a little bit more vibrant, which is fine with me because I'm not a huge fan of the... I like the atmosphere, but, I don't know, it just could look a little bit nicer. Not really lore-friendly, I guess, but, I don't know. I thought it would look cool. Well, if I don't like it, I'll just take it off. Uh, water should look nicer as well. A few other things. I don't know. Shouldn't matter too much. It's still in the early stages of development. This game has been out for like approximately a month. So I wouldn't expect too many great things to be out. But I got some texture optimization stuff. So hopefully things run a bit smoother. Those, so, so far, while I was testing out the mods to make sure my game wouldn't be crashing left and right. Uh, loading screens seem to have increased in time, which is unfortunate, but, uh, it should be okay. Alright, so what exactly am I doing again? We are going... Is it a new quest? Meet Deacon at the old highway. Alright, what highway are we talking about? I don't know. Oh, I see it. I see it. Eh, there it is. Um. Alright, I guess we'll just head to Lexington and go from there. So these loading screens, the fast travel loading screens are the one that usually take a while. So we'll see if that holds up here. Hopefully not, but it's looking like it's on track to normally my game would have loaded by now. I probably should have installed the game on my solid state drive, but I just, I don't know. My solid state doesn't have that much memory or storage, so I wasn't sure I wanted to do that. For those wondering, I have a 500, not terabyte, 500 gigabyte solid state, 2 terabyte hard drive, and a 4 terabyte hard drive. 4 terabytes mainly just for recording. 2 terabytes where I install most of my games, so... Ideally, I would have like a two terabyte solid state drive, but that's probably fucking expensive as shit. So, I'm not gonna do that for now. Oh, another cool one I got is um, when you walk around. You might have noticed that my gun isn't being held like this all the time. Whenever I'm walking around not shooting, my character just holds the gun out, just walks like uh like they normally would. I thought I don't know. It's cool. I think it's fine. It seems more kind of realistic. A little bit of immersion added, actually. No need to hold your gun out like this all the time when you could just carry it at your side. So I thought that was kind of cool. Are you guys hostile? What guns do I have again? How about melee? Shit. That's how? Ideally, didn't want to waste ammo on those guys, but uh, one 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 that I did add that may or may not be considered a cheat is craftable ammo. Because ammo, frankly, I think it's completely realistic to be able to craft ammo with the certain right materials. And um, don't know why it wasn't included in the game to begin with. So I thought it was totally fine to add it with the mod. So hopefully people don't get too mad at me for adding that, but. Chances are, I don't, I don't know. I've never really crafted anything to begin with, so. Oh, there's some two-headed cows. Oh yeah, nighttime is supposed to be darker. The sky should look nice. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at how beautiful that is. 4K textures for the sky. A lot of stars. Looks very pretty. Every time I move, it kind of shimmers a little bit, which is kind of cool. That is beautiful. Yeah, so the night's a little bit darker with the darkness mod. Doesn't really do much. Doesn't, I mean, it doesn't benefit me at all, honestly, but. Okay. Uh, what gun do I want to use on these guys? That's a turret.
Got some kind of laser gun. Alright, turret needs to die. Taking too much damage. Having some trouble aiming. Can you not shoot my dog, please? Thank you. Alright, give me all that shit. I'll take what I can get. Alright, well, um, I thought I was supposed to meet him on the other highway. Okay, how do I... Not the right way to go. Okay. Whoops. I fucked up. Oop. It says these guys are hostile, but they just run away, so... Oh, there he is. Hello, uh, what's his face? What's his name? Deacon, is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander Camo. Sure. This is my pile of garbage, asshole. Back off. Good, right? <laughs> You're lucky I didn't do one of my face swaps, too. Hmm. You can change your face. I put myself under the knife every year or two. New face, new body, you know, the full makeover. It keeps our enemies guessing. I almost didn't recognize you. That's the point. So, about the job. The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. That sounds really, really bad. Tough break. And then some. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. Let's find it then. We gotta do one thing first. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump him for information before we dive in. For now, I'll take point. Hey, it's kind of nice when other people take point. Symbols we use to send messages to each other. If you like that, we got signs and counter signs, dead drops, even a secret handshake. All right, maybe the handshake never got on. Anyway, the tourist should have a trail left for us. Can we go a little bit faster? Fuck, <laughs> so slow. Ugh. So yeah, crafting ammo should be helpful because I'm constantly very low, which I guess is kind of the point of the game, but I don't know. I'm not looking for that much of a challenge. I guess if I wanted to not have to worry about ammo, I would invest into a melee build, but I'm really not feeling melee builds. Here we go. Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. So our tourist really? is up ahead. Let's what gave it away? <laughs> Man, I never would have guessed. How did you get here? I just can't get over the fact that the sky looks really fucking pretty. Like, goddamn. Is this our tourist? One of the loading screens decided to tell me that uh, feral ghouls should not be classified as zombies or technically just people who have lost their minds because the radiation d just melted their minds which in my eyes is basically a zombie but I guess all right all right whatever you want to potatoes potatoes you know we can call them ghouls though no problem because ghoul is one syllable but uh, I think they're zombies oh hello Are you really having trouble? Come on. At this point, I've learned to just take everything you, almost everything you can, because you can probably just drop it off real quick. Quantum, that's a good thing. I'm pretty sure that restores a lot of health. 
Doesn't really matter at this point quite yet because we don't have a lot of health anyways. Wish this would go a little bit faster. Oh. You can do it, man. We can go a little. There we go. Let's pick up the pace a little bit, eh? Plus in the center. That means there's an ally nearby. Arturas, you take point on the conversation. Look, no matter what he says, you just say mine is in the shop. Trust me. No matter what he says, eh? All right, let's not fuck this up. Hey there. Once your friend gets here, how about we have a chat, huh? Oh, thank God. You have a Geiger counter? You have a goddamn Geiger counter? <laughs> Mine is in the shop. Who the hell is he? HQ said they were sending one agent, not two. Sorry, I'm new. She's just showing me the ropes. All right. The wall is my witness. I thought I was dead. About goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here. Hey, none of these are the right option. Mine is in the shop. Tell me what's going on. I signed on for some light recon. But that little slocum's Joe of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dome synth sons of bitches. Runs fortified to hell and back. They place mines all over the goddamn place. What do you mean by chrome dome synths? You know, them early model synths. Looks like metal wrapped over mechanical innards. You see them here and there doing who knows what for the Institute. Good to know I'll be going. I appreciate all you've done. I hope it helps. I really do. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, better ask soon. Nah, we're good. Don't need no intel. Hey there. Well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? You think he's telling the truth? He's probably telling the truth. But you never know. I agree. Odds are good we can take him at face value. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So we're going in through the escape tunnel. <laughs> Minefield or not. Let's move out. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. I don't even know where I'm going. All right. All right, man. <laughs> okay. Can I loot anything? You got anything I I could use around here? Can I pickpocket you? What do you got? Uh, you got some ammo. Uh, I think it's worth it. Let's go for it. Yeah. Yeah. See, no biggie. No biggie. He'll never know. Never even know it was gone. All right. How do we get down here without dying? Probably not this way. Let's go somewhere else. Uh, how did I get up here again? It's gotta be a safe way down. I still can't get over the fact that uh, it's fucking Jack from Mass Effect Two, or and Three, I guess. Mass Effect in general. Not the nothing wrong with that. I think it's just cool. Seeing uh, voice actors and actresses pop up across various games. One, uh, I mean, one of the most distinctive voices has got to be Laura Bailey. Haven't quite. I don't think I've heard her in this game. She's probably not in this game, honestly. But she's in quite a few. So she's also got a very distinctive voice. So it's not hard to tell when you come across her. Anywho, what's that? That is power armor. Excuse me. And this will unlock it, probably. Alright, let's see. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright. I promise you I didn't mod anything about hacking. That was complete luck. Which is cool. But we don't need a... I'll take the fusion core, actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll be taking that. Thank you. 
I guess I should be using this a little bit more. But the sun is rising, so it shouldn't matter too much anymore. Hello? Oh. Like I said already, the darkness enhancement thing for night doesn't really help me at all. I just think it's a little bit more immersive. You know, because nights in real life are pretty dark. So. Alright. Into the sewer we go. They didn't even bother locking the door, but it's okay, because that works out for us. Life is just jolly good. Apparently, there is also... Uh, someone left a comment on one of the earlier videos saying that there is a way to get the cry later out of Vault 111 um, with the cheat, with dog meat, because apparently dog meat can just get it for you. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Carrington. Let's sure. find a prototype then. Together with you, I like our odds. First step. Don't forget about dog meat. Like I was saying though, apparently dog meat can kind of cheat your way into the cry later, but I don't want to do that. I, it's not a big deal. I can unlock, what's it called? Uh, where's my perk chart? There it is. I can unlock master lock picking at level 18, which I'm almost there anyways, so I don't need to cheat to do that. I can just unlock that in three levels. I think the next thing I was working on was getting to science, so I need to get my intelligence up further which is fine because it increases the amount of XP which will let me level up a little bit faster anyway so it's all good it'll work out this is the exit no doubt oh no it's not just kidding well the terminals on at least no way I'm, I'm gonna feed it some this. passwords no all right he's a master hacker apparently no. ah. uh, what level is master hacking unlocked at just out of curiosity 21. Okay, so. Kind of close. Kind of not. We'll get there eventually. Like, if I really wanted to, I could just use the console to give myself a bunch of XP, but we're playing this game as legit as we can. The, the mods I added were just for aesthetics. Like, th having my gun, sh like, held down like this when I'm not doing anything doesn't help me. It just looks nicer. Alright, it's definitely... Is someone present? Synth. I was gonna say ghoul, but all right, we're gonna whip out the righteous authority for these guys. It's very powerful. We can just oh, hello. Wait, see the box in the center of that rail sign? I was in error. Is it a cash no enemy Looks like Maven managed to hide something before it. Look around. Alright, we'll keep an eye out. Probably gonna miss it. Not very observant when it comes to these kinds of games. Barely slow the course down, but hey, probably save some lives. I don't think you've ever seen a courser. They're top of the line in Institute. Let's fuck up your day tech. That is a lot of guys. Wish my aim was a little bit better. Now we restock our ammo. That's good. Sly Nicholas. Why is that his name? Whatever. <laughs> a lot of, uh, random shit lying around. I am curious what it would take to craft uh, fusion cells. Because those would be the best investment, I would say. Where's this terminal? Did I miss something? Where's the terminal? I don't see shit. Alright, maybe I'm just very unobservant, but I don't see a terminal. Mm. Over oh, there sensor. it is. Wow. Nothing more. Oh, Deacon went down. That's unfortunate. Engaging 
Hostile life form. Totally fine. Deacon will eat the bullets for me. See? He's got me. What's with all these people? Nice to get my ammo back as soon as I use it. I want to get my sneak up so I can just sneak around and not have to worry about being detected, but that's an investment for another day. I can do this terminal. Alright, let's say, uh, sound. Oh my god, what the fuck? Did I get, did I accidentally get some kind of... Alright, we need to, we need to unlock another terminal to see if this is actually just me getting lucky as fuck. Because this is unbelievable. This, this luck has been unbelievable. Let's be, let's be honest, the odds of me picking right on my first try twice in a row, very low. Very, very low. Oh, hello. I need some more. I need to find another terminal. See, this is not a hacking terminal. Bunch of shit that I don't need to know about. Excellent. All right, here we go. This is an expert terminal. I should not be able to hack this on the first try. Otherwise, I fuck something up. Okay, yeah, okay, okay. Relax. I did not hack the game to make it instant hacking. I was just getting super fucking lucky. Alright, anyways. So we need to find something that has one in common with interface. I don't know why I picked interface. Uh, how about available? Um, does this have any in common except the E at the end? I think it has to have an E at the end, if I'm calculating things right. So by my... So it could be warehouse. No, oh, okay, it does not have to have an E at the end. What the fuck? Okay, well I guess that makes sense. It has one in common with available, and one in common with interface, and it does not end with an E. Okay. Okay. Fuck. Uh, it has nothing in common with warehouse either, which is helpful, I guess. So it's not murderous. Sorry, this is actually semi difficult, and there's a lot of letters to work with here. <laughs> it's not catacombs. Can it be separated? Alright, I need to think about this a little bit harder. Occupants. It can't be occupants. Actually, it could be. Wait. No. No, it can't be occupants. How about batteries? Alright, let's, let's do this methodically. How about batteries? Can it be batteries? No, it can't. Okay. Interface. We already did interface. Furniture. Cannot be furniture. Warehouse. We already did warehouse. Tolerance. Cannot be tolerance. Catacombs? Uh, I don't think it can be catacombs. No, it can't be catacombs. Okay. Murderous. I think I already established this one. Did I? Cannot be murderous. Okay. Paintings. 
can't be paintings. Separated? I think it can be separated. Yes. Yeah, okay. Sweet. So what did that do exactly? Hell yeah. Permanently more difficult to detect while sneaking. That's nice. Okay, there's another terminal here. We'll work on it. You get XP for doing it, so let's go with decisions. There we go. Okay, I am officially the luckiest person, at least for the last half hour on the planet. Like fuck. What does all this mean? I didn't really help, but... Or did it? Did I read something there that I should have, uh, seen? No password or anything? No. Dude. I fucking... This one was a little hard, but... I got it without failing. The I got the first. I got the last two on the first try, and I got that most recent one on the fucking second try. So, what is this? Or did I get it on the first try? I think I got it on the first try or second try. First or second try, definitely. Damn. Give me those fusion cells. All right, our objective is that way, so let's actually see what's on the other side. What's on the other side? The bathroom. What's behind advanced door number one? Nope, oh, this way. Nope, that was really close. Fuck. Should have had it. Come on. It's right. It's right there. There you go. Nice. Ooh. Oh, don't know why I took that pistol. Whatever. Where did Deacon go? <laughs> why is he no helping me? Medical supplies are always welcome. Anything in the toilet I should know about? Someone had a... OD on the toilet, that's very unfortunate. What about this bathroom? Nasty as uh, expected, someone left seven in the man's bathroom, someone left seven bobby pins in the, in the, the mirror. Why? Why? The man bun's too much to handle? Alright. Is someone present? Yes. That is a mannequin. By order of the institute, it must be destroyed. <laughs> the institute. Oh. Oh, I didn't. Oh, okay. I'm almost dead, actually. Come on, really? That was the synth leader, apparently. Is that a new leg I see? New left leg? Is it this one? Just increases my radiation resistance, which doesn't really matter. Well, I mean, it's a little helpful, but I've picked up a lot of stuff apparently. Okay, did not realize I had that much shit on me. When did I? What do I have that? Fire extinguisher weighs six pounds. Yeah, let's uh, let's drop that. <laughs> Picked up 
pipe pistol, I want to say, that I don't need. Yeah, so we don't need that. Alright, that'll alleviate us for the time being. Where's that play button? Carrington, Stanley, Salas, Crotty, Supplement Legs. says I will. Thank God someone managed to close the security door. Carrington's prototype is I already have a hazmat hazmat suit. Scanning. So Tommy Whispers didn't make it out. He died protecting our secrets. Nice. Let me see. There. Tommy would want you to have his hand cap. Mini nuke? Don't let it size fool you. I appreciate it. May it serve you as well, heck better than it did Tommy. Sure. Grab Carrington's prototype. You turn that over to Desdemona, and she'll have to let you into our merry band. Deviled eggs. Where's that play button? Carrington, Stanley, Salas, and Crote, Supreme Legs. Open says me. There's an elevator at the end of the hall. It should be a hell of a lot easier fighting the chrome domes on this side of the minefield. Uh, where are we going? How do we get there? Is there another way out of here that I don't know about? Take a. Am I supposed to go somewhere else? Just keep going this way. Oh, okay, that works. Research terminal. Anything I should know about here? A lot of text. Nah. There's gotta be a way to get in there somehow. I don't know what it is with these monkeys, but I feel like they're important. Semi. Apparently I have a missile launcher. I don't know when I picked that up. Okay, that is an actual sniper rifle. That, uh, gonna hold on to that, obviously. Um, I need to get out of here so I can sell a bunch of my stuff. But in the meantime, I guess we'll just dump some junk. What weighs a lot. What is weighing me down? Did I see that right? Five pounds? Yeah, let's go ahead and drop that. Alright, open sesame. See if I can get lucky again. Probably not. I don't know. Yeah, okay. My luck was bound to run out at some point. Alright, so it can't be pass. Can't be wins. Can't be fair roll. Can't be parts. Could be herbs. Alright, so it does not end with an S. Okay. Cannot be extra. Cannot be saves. Can't be nears. Can't be storm. Could be samba. Oh, okay. Ah, fuck. What am I doing? Uh, safer. Nice. Yeah. Open sesame. What do we got? Is 
some medicine that I have still yet to ever use, but I could probably sell for a good chunk of money. Is that it? Alright, well I guess I can't expect too much to be locked behind, uh... Novice door, and I'm over encumbered, and let's... Alright, we need to just... Dump something. Alright, sorry fan. Probably gonna have to dump more stuff, because we're gonna find something on our way out, most likely. Ripperino. I don't know when the last save was, so that's no good. God damn it. Oh fuck. That's not too far back, I guess. There's an elevator at the end of the hall. It should be a hell of a lot easier fighting the chrome domes on this side of the minefield. Yeah, let's go ahead and dump the stuff in advance this time, I guess. Okay. Good to know that there was that. That that was a thing. Um What am I doing? Junk. Let's dump some junk. Alright, hot plates are helpful because of the circuitry. The fan can go... Do I need a plunger? No, I don't need a plunger. That, it's only steel, don't need that. Did I just get that glue? I don't think I think I missed that last time. I missed this last time. All right, let's go hack that terminal again. I fucked up, but did not pay attention to the. Don't actually see where the mine is, but oh, dog meat! Don't give a shit. <laughs> He's just going right on in. Yeah, let's grab jangles. Let's rehack this. Uh, world. Okay. So it's not saves. Sense. It's not sense. It's not exist. Falls. Could be falls. Okay. It's not Daisy. Could be books. Fuck. Okay. So it could be Viper. No. Could be Virus. No. March? Could be March? Thrill. Yeah. I always do that. Alright. To re grab what we lost. Good stuff. Nuka Cola. Alright, let's go ahead and save just in case I fuck up again. <laughs> just in case. Where the fuck is the mine? What? Is it not here? What did I- <laughs> What the fuck? Why did I step on it last time? Alright. Somehow I triggered the mine that- was just not there this time. Interesting. Unfortunately, these guys don't carry stim packs on them, but it's okay. Now let's end of the line. Just power up the elevator. Sweet roll. I think we're good. 
Oh, oh, oh. What? Dog meat? I just cut my dog in half. That was not good. That was not good. <laughs> Alright. These hot plates weigh a lot. That's to be expected, but it's worth it. I, I just need to figure out what's in my inventory and then just dump a bunch of shit. Alright. Uh, drop the saw. God damn it. <laughs> I'm making poor decisions right now. Uh, does anything here weigh a lot that I don't need? I don't know. Alright, let's dump more junk for now. Hmm. Hmm. This shouldn't be that hard, I'm just... Biometric scanner seems helpful, I don't want to dump that. Uh, wrench can go, I guess. So I'll be solved. I can just get home. And then just dump off all this junk. But it's not helping my case when I just pick up random shit like that. What does a Braxa cleaner do for me, actually? Acid, fiberglass, antiseptic. That's actually kind of helpful. Okay. Dump another hammer. Right, we need to fast travel to the Red Rocket and get out of here. Which I think we're good because we picked up the prototype so we should be good to go. Should be no more stuff. Our, our reward for the mission was the pistol thing. So, yeah. Oh fuck! <laughs> that is a nice ghetto badass looking minigun. Shit. Very heavy too. It's gotta be heavy. Is someone present? Oh. <sighs> Still more guys. Hello. Oh, okay. Confuse themselves before we leave. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is my fucking thing locking onto? Almost died there because of that. <laughs> yeah, All right, I saw that coming. If it's like Skyrim, it won't let me travel until I'm not over encumbered. So once again, gonna have to dump some stuff. But the military circuit board seems like it could be helpful. Is that some more? Nuke Cola. Hot plate. Alright, this seems like a worthy investment if I can just find something to dump. Just gotta grab this ammo. Hello? Uh, okay. Alright, how much am I carrying? 272. Shit, I picked up too much stuff. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. Alright, I might have to dump a weapon or something that I don't necessarily... Or, uh, or clothes. Okay, could drop that. Could drop that. Alright, four pounds. I don't necessarily want to drop this stuff because they're worth a lot, relatively. So I don't know, let's just go back to the junk. Just gotta dump four pounds of stuff. All right. 
I can do this. What is the most useless here? Copper and steel? Is copper common? I don't see copper too often. The telephone is copper. Toy car? Nah, I can drop that. Drop the rocket ships. There's copper. Okay, maybe we can dump the power relay coil thing. Okay, just need to drop like half a pound more. Alright, are we good? What the f What the fuck was that? Alright, we're getting out of here before we run into another stupid mine. <laughs> Sorry, Deacon. I'm going home, man.